Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be doing a favorite look of mine for fall, and I was so excited to do this tutorial, and I'm just going to be starting out with my primer. This is by Pure Cosmetics, and it is illuminating, and I love how gentle and also just how it's not silicone-based because I don't like silicone primers. And this here is my lip balm. I just have to hydrate my lips before I start my foundation. I am using the flat top foundation brush. It's really great to blend out and I just love how flawless the application looks. So I'm also going to be using my MAC foundation. This is Studio Fix Fluid. You guys know it's like my number one foundation I've been using for years. So I just apply a small pump and apply it all over my face. Okay, so next I am going in with concealer. I am using the All May Anti-Aging Concealer, which I have been really liking, and it's full coverage, and it's a drugstore price, drugstore brand, so can never go wrong with that. And yeah, I just put it around my nose, my lips, and also I'm gonna be using the Pink Squishy Blender to blend everything out just flawlessly, and it's just very smooth, and I love it. Another thing I love about the Pink Squishy is it's actually angled to get underneath the eyes perfectly so it's really really nice at blending it out and it's just super gentle. Next I am going into my makeup bag that I carry in my purse and grabbing out my translucent powder Charlotte Tilbury and I love this one it's like an airbrush finish and it's so nice I absolutely love it and I'm going to be using my full face powder brush uh, just to apply it here it's the expert face which is like one of my favorites and just apply it all over my skin. Okay, so next is brow time. I am going in with Cabrow. This is by Benefit and the angled eye brush here. And I'm just going to do up my brows. I love this stuff. You guys have heard me rave about it. I've had it in tons of my favorite videos. It is like my new brow favorite because it really holds into place all day. I find the product just really easy to spread. So I have been loving it. You can see how big of a difference it makes having it in my brows. And a second brow product that I use, this one is by Essence. It's just like a brow um, gel and it just really, really holds it into place and also just makes my brow hairs go up which typically they like to stick down so <laughs> it's definitely been a lifesaver product and next I'm just going in with my Too Faced bronzer the chocolate soleil and I love just warming up my face a little bit especially during the winter months because I get a little bit more pale and so I love to just go around the jawline and then of course get a little bit of that contour going on and I'm just using the angled blush to apply it and I find you just get the perfect contour and next I'm going in with the large fluff I love this brush for a nose contour it just gets the perfect contour and also I'm just going in with the same powder that I just used for my bronzer chocolate soleil and I find the color works really well I find it works really well on my skin tone and next I'm going to go into my eye brushes here and I'm actually going to be using this hourglass palette and it's called the um, Modernist Micro Chrome Eyeshadow Palette and it's one of the first times I'm actually using this and I just love it because it's like all matte. It's got like a tiny bit of shimmer in there and they're all really fall colors and I wanted to do kind of like a purpley smoky eye today and yeah so I'm just applying the um, light color all over the lid which is like a lilac purple. And just going in with the eye blending brush, I am going to be taking the mid-tone color right here. It's like a deeper purple and just blending that out into the crease. <laughs> Okay, now to deepen the look a little bit, since it is fall, I'm going in with the dark purple now, uh, just in the outer V, and I absolutely love it. It's like a matte dark purple, and it's something that I actually haven't worn in a really long time, and I forgot how much I love purple eyes, so I was really, really excited for you guys to see this look, and please give this a video a thumbs up if you guys are enjoying this video so far, and sorry, Ryan is just talking to me right now, of course, while I am filming. <laughs> But yeah, I just thought I'd explain why my mouth is moving so much. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to just blend that out on the lower lash line as well and blend, blend, blend um, all the colors since I am doing more of like a smokier eye today. And now going in with the lightest color in this palette, I am just going to be placing it right underneath the brow bone just to really, really clean up this look. 
Now going in with the Wet n Wild, this is just a plain black liner. I'm just going to be placing that on the upper lash line and I will be smoking it out. And also on the waterline as well and lower lash line. Now going in with that same angled eye brush that I used for my brows, I'm just going to be smoking out that liner on the lower lash line and upper lash line as well. Okay, so now going in with the Charlotte Tilbury, this is their uh, cat liner, and I absolutely love it. It's perfect. It's got the perfect tip, so it's really easy to apply. And I'm doing a little bit of a wing with this look. I loved wing liner look, so yeah, I'm going to apply it on both eyes. And also what I really like about this, it doesn't smudge at all, so I have been enjoying it. Now for mascara, it was so hard to choose. I've just been trying out so many mascaras lately, but I honestly love this one. It's The Real by Benefit. And I just applied it on the upper lash line and lower lash line as well. I find it separates your lashes great. It gives a lot of length and also a lot of volume. I also love how quickly it dries, but moving on to my lashes. I am using the Shroomori Lash Glue, which is my favorite, and for lashes I chose Full On Glam and Fluffy Layered, and I love this combo right now. It's super fall, they're more dramatic, and I just love them. So I'm applying them right now, and obviously I went for a little bit more of a smokier eye, which, I mean, of course you can throw on more dramatic lashes, so that is why I double stacked these ones. Okay, so next for lips, this is the new color that I'm using. This is the Warm Bronze by Anastasia. It is like my new fall favorite. It is a gorgeous color, and I thought it'd be perfect for this look. And now just taking my fan brush, which is one of my favorites. I'm going to be going in with Moonlight by Hourglass. I love it. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous highlight color, and I'm just going to be putting that right above my bronzer. Okay, and next going in with the cheeks, this is Cheekathon by Benefit. I love this palette and I just went in with like a warm orange color. I thought it'd be perfect to finish off this look. Okay guys, so this is my favorite fall look right now and I hope you guys really enjoyed watching this tutorial and thank you guys so much for voting on my Twitter poll to do this video first. Like I said, I will have my fall uh, what's in my bag video coming for you guys and of course, if you guys are not subscribed to my channel, make sure to subscribe now and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! Until you listen to your song